Remember I told you before, I blame Magic Johnson for bringing LeBron James to Lakers. But it was done as a means to kind of, while Kobe had won and, and built back good graces after what happened in 03 or 04, his last few years were not memorable. He was hurt and he was the shell of himself and he got older and he retired and the Lakers stunk. And LeBron had this good, Samaritan badge bestowed upon him and it was like okay he was one of the most important players and you know etc so it's like let's bring him here and magic of course being magic because it's always about dollars and cents and putting people in seats but also he was the flip side of Kobe he was a nice guy nice wholesome man no problems Everybody loved him, great teammate, all that. I wonder how Magic feels today that, well, Magic got hoodwinked with uh, Lonzo Ball, even though Lonzo Ball is a good ball when he can play. He can handle the ball. He just shouldn't have been that high draft pick. And playing in L.A. is a lot of pressure. So didn't you not use common sense when you went out and got Lonzo Ball and then y'all stuck with Bronny J? But anyway, another story, another video, another time. But... LeBron was used as a good PR front. They needed somebody with a big name. They needed some cachet. Somehow Laker lore and all that, you know, that that was like, we got to do this. It's part of the grand scheme of the acting. So he was used as a PR pitch man. Win a ring, bubble ring, Walmart trophy, church camp trophy, all those little nuances break records in Lake Alor. We're going to try to use you to make us kind of move past Kobe. Mm -hmm. You never heard this mess before. No one ever thought of when Vlada Divas came in behind Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. There was nothing like that. No one looked at, no one, even as great as Kobe was, no one saw him. It's not like you pass the magic. Shaq with Kareem, you know, it, it didn't have to do a PR thing because the memories were in, in, in set in stone. This is on some whole dozen different trajectory, made up, made believe, like, let's create this. Wow. He doesn't, he's never looked right in a Laker uniform. And he'll never be one of the 10 greatest Lakers ever. You Laker fans know what I'm talking about. But the Magic PR Foundation was like, let's do this. And we all bought into a genie, but all that because they were in disarray. And how does LA solve a problem? They don't work through the draft. No, no. We don't ask our coaches to, you know, extra access. No, we need to go get a star. We need to go find a star. We need to get somebody that can fill seats up. And yeah, except he's been very polarizing in LA. And I agree with Skip. Ba I'm not a Skip Bayless fan. However, Skip Bayless said if he if he never said another truth, he was right. The man that spent more time chasing Michael B. Jordan than he's chasing Michael Jordan. Whack movies and agendas. And on top of that, just trying anything with all the free agent signings they didn't had, the people they didn't had come through, running through coaches taking a news analyst and say, hey, you want to be a head coach because we're doing a podcast together? Just anything, any gimmick you can imagine. Yeah, you're right. I mean, he's very different than Kobe, but he's a people pleaser. He wants everybody, you know. Um, He just may as well call him LeBron James. Should have been with the floaters. You remember the song Float On? I'm LeBron Ramon James and I'm a Libra and I like everybody and everything. And I want you to float on. Come on to LA. I mean, that's why he may as well be singing the song. But, you know, it, it, it's, it's a lot of PR going on. But it's not about basketball. It's a lot of distractions. I don't think Le Kobe would have been too pleased with what he's seeing. I know Shaq's not. Cats who really wore that purple and gold and really put the time in and really did the thing. 
they cringing at what LeBron done done. But Magic had a hand in this. Had a hand in it. All about selling tickets. All about being in the video. Oh, oh never mind. We know who said that already. We know where this is going. Everything revolves around everything but the game itself. Why is that? Please like, subscribe, welcome thoughts, comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. Share it if you like. Hit that membership. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Stay true. Stay woke. Stay real. I'm out one time. Peace.